big shiny red like, one. Like I wouldn't be working at my store. You wouldn't be. Yeah. Don't worry for this freaking game. I'm not even kidding right now. Like Tell I wish I were exaggerating. Tell the story. What story. There was a story behind you getting a what? job at Best Buy. There was this guy, and I told him that I played Legend of Zelda, and he was like, "Name all the Legend of Zelda games," and I was like, "I," and I almost did it in a chronological order. He was like, well, By it's super, <laughs> super impressive. And I was oh, like, all right. Super. So he like recommended me when I applied for a job there. If being able to name all the Legend of Zelda games that have come well, out Well, I got super hired for the... He just got shot point blank. I did. Yeah, this is definitely That was me. pathetic. <laughs> <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Judge them. <laughs> Get him! And him! <laughs> I'm not gonna let him get away with that. And him! <laughs> I'm gonna let him get away with <laughs> Ain't no way. That was awesome. It anyway. Was, <laughs> just snipe me right off the wall. You gonna do that to me? <laughs> no, it was stupid. I, I mean, like, I'm glad I got the job. I really appreciate it. But, like, the reason that he got me hired was really stupid, so... Not not Zelda. I mean, like, I, I mean, to me, that's not a legitimate reason to get hired. No, I'm glad no, it right. happened. You're right. It's not a legitimate reason because there are so many people in this world who need jobs who could totally do that. Yeah, <laughs> it's not like Zelda's like some sort of obscure like franchise. I mean, it's not hard to name all the Zelda titles if you're no. into that sort of thing. It's kind of like it's almost. I like, think at the time I had only even played. Um, I don't. Had I even played Wind Waker yet? Was I working at Best Buy when I finished Wind Waker? I think, I think you were in the middle of playing Ocarina of Time on the emulator. No, I had already finished that. I was still working at uh, Express when I finished Ocarina. Oh. All I know <clears throat> is that you, you cried at the end of Wind Waker and you know it made what? me cry. No, listen, I'm glad that you cried. <laughs> because it, it gave me a new release on life. <laughs> a new release on life. Release. Oh, not, that was a hidden talent, release. by the way. It was. We just talked right over it. Did we even do the move? Yeah. <laughs> what was it? What was it? <laughs> I don't know. This is a hidden skill, hidden talent. What is he? What can he play the piano now? <laughs> he does watercolors. <laughs> there's a in Bioshock in one of the DLC. Um, there's like a um, a plasmid that's like like piano protege or something that you can splice and you can splice to get really good at the piano and then you sit down and you play uh, awesome. Cohen's chair. So. <laughs> That's really cool. <laughs> it was like, what are we doing? I have no idea. I'm really sorry. This is obviously <laughs> entry or entry. Wow, Marble Hornets. I'm stuck on it. <laughs> entry. I, well, because sometimes we refer to entry like there's an the entry where Alex and Jay argue in the parking lot, and that's called entry breakup. So I was about to be like, obviously this is entry. What the heck are we doing? <laughs> but it's not an entry, so excuse me. It's, it's session. What the heck are we doing? <laughs> Episode. Episode. What the heck I, are we doing? I feel like I just like wanted to go and kill people. Oh, it's because we didn't do this. Did we? Why I don't is... really understand what's I wasn't happening watching. right now. I wasn't even watching. I was so caught up in your anecdote. It was such a good anecdote. What is going on? Why is he eating my head? Where am I? What year is it? What's your name? Who are you? It's 1942. <laughs> the day after Pearl Harbor. Oh, <laughs> Why did we not do this before? Oh, I think we wanted to see what would happen if we said that we weren't ready. Oh, yeah, and he was just like, well, go away. <laughs> it's a lot funnier when we actually intend to do it. Whoops. Come at me. Come at me, bro. Oh, old meme is old. Mm. Once a meme gets put on a shirt, it's old. He has no torso. No, he doesn't. So what am I? What am I hitting? Finishing move. What am I? What am I stabbing my sword into? There's no torso His there. His soul. His... <laughs> Excellent. It appears you are certainly capable of performing my lost. Oh, oh my god. I think we were commenting on the fact that he has no like body. I'm pretty sure we do that every single time. <laughs> Very well. My second skill is ellipses. The power of grammatical <laughs> punctuation. The shield attack. A well-placed silence. <laughs> it's the best way to uh, throw off your foes in battle. <laughs> no matter how well-tempered a blade is, if a foe is clad in armor and bears a shield, the sword will do it no harm. I feel like the right sword might be able to pierce some armor. Especially if it's made out of leaves like you got. <laughs> it's got leafy armor. Is it leaves? It looks kind of like ivy. Ivy? 
Ivy sore? Like Ivy sore? Like threw up on it? Like <laughs> sure. Makes a Pokemon joke. <laughs> when facing such a foe, you must lock it's on with the Z and thrust the nunchuck thrust. forward to thrust your thrust. Why does he use thrust, thrust. twice? Thrust, thrust, thrust. <laughs> Use Z to lock on to me, then try it. Thrust. <laughs> you, ha you have learned to thrust. <laughs> <laughs> you will know the moment when you can thrust. <laughs> it's, a, it's a rite of passage for a man to learn thrust. to thrust. <laughs> That's it, this episode's named Thrust. <laughs> now thrust. <laughs> now thrust. Thrust at me, bro. Thrust. I'm not, I can't do it. This. No one ever uses this move. <laughs> what is this? It's a, th it's a thrust. Oh. It's the pelvic thrust. Dude, what kind of a move would that be? You, you get like, you thrust the shield off, and then it opens him up for attack. But it's really hard. I love it when he teaches you a move and you take forever, and he's like, what's wrong with you? <laughs> and he's like, you dumb! See, there you go. Is. <laughs> Terminator. Open a hole in your thrust. <laughs> <laughs> open, a, open a hole in your enemy's thruster. <laughs> what's, what exactly is a thruster? <laughs> Shield attack. Oh, I use that. I never a, use it. Occasionally. Ever, ever, ever. Like there's specific enemies where you're supposed to use it. Yeah, but there's other ways around that. Whatever. I use it on those weird little turtle things. A lot of times, I like to do like the the roll behind. No, that's in Wind Waker. Do they have that in this too? Well, and you need to know this because of obviously that's not anything that comes up frequently in a Zelda game. No. Right there. This? That's nothing. No. You're never going to see this ever again in any game ever, especially not this one. No. This is completely irrelevant. I don't know why they put it in there. I have no idea, especially when you got like empty bottles. That works just fine. Sure. Yeah, man. That's even better sometimes. Done. <laughs> I've actually never done that. I've actually heard that, like, using the empty bottles is, like, way harder than actually using the sword to do that. Empty bottles? Yeah, like in, uh, in Ocarina of Time, when you're facing Ganondorf, you can, like, defeat him with an empty bottle. But do you, like, catch it? You, no, when you're whole, when you're playing, like, energy ball tennis. Yeah. Yeah, you just... Yeah, like, when you do the animation to catch it, it, like, punches the energy ball back. It's harder, though. Like, you have, your timing has to be a lot more specific, like spot on. I don't have timing. <laughs> at all. Ain't no one got timing for that. <laughs> Shut up. I make jokes. Thrust. Thrusting. Thrust. He's ex he's planning out his thrust of attack. That's his thrust face. <laughs> <laughs> that is a serious thrust face. If someone came out with me with that face with the intention to thrust, I think I would run away. <laughs> I don't know, if it were Link, you might, like, stand there and be like, is this really happening? Is this really so, happening? so, so, are we, are, are we doing this, or? <laughs> Apparently we were talking wow. about thrusting. <laughs> I don't think we were. I don't think we talked about thrusting at all the first time no, we did this. No, we would not. We did not. I what are just, we doing? We're looking at his profile. He looks so angry. He's just, I don't know. What even, is going on? I don't think he looks angry. I don't like us. <laughs> Why are we doing this? What kind of emotion is on his face right now? seriousness seriousness serious business i don't think he's like upset or angry he's just serious he's just ready to kick some butt. yeah he's ready to some he's a pona <laughs> i mean yeah <laughs> <laughs> he's a zebra Thrust. <laughs> shut up <laughs> <laughs> dude elizabeth showed me this like crazy do i want to know meme do they want to know I, I guess so. Have, oh. Did you ever see Lion King 2? Um, yes, a long time ago. And there was this one song, and it was like, Deception, disgrace, evil as plain as the scar on his face. And then, like, the, like the little, like, the son of Scar or whatever was getting, like, cast out of the pride and stuff. How do you, what are we doing? <laughs> We're on the screen forever. Um, there we go. Yay. <laughs> Five more, huh? But anyway, like, there was a meme, and, like, these zebras were going, like, deception! <laughs> like, they were making, like, a horrified, disgusted face. <laughs> and they, like... What? So me and Elizabeth called them the deception zebras. <laughs> How do you inherit a scar? No, well, I mean, he got a scar. Just like his father? <laughs> yeah, I mean, like, through life. Who did Scar even have a kid with? 
I don't know. Probably like a hyena. <laughs> you need to calm down. <laughs> God. What in God's name would a cross with a lion and hyena look so like? Just <laughs> Stop. A hyena? No. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, are we done with this? What was with that long ass pause? I don't know. I just keep. I, I think that's like the fourth time I've killed that mom in like this. Session. Well, they always like come back. Of course they do. Stupid. I was watching a video on like the beta stuff for Twilight Princess, and it was actually pretty interesting. There was supposed to be a magic meter and everything. And you were supposed to like. Like, the idea was that maybe you used magic to turn into a wolf. Instead of like, yeah. and oh. there was gonna, and there was gonna be like light and or there was gonna be um fire and ice and light arrows and stuff. And so, but they decided to get rid of that. I kind of like the way they did it. Yeah, I'll send you the video. It's pretty good. Hmm. It's got a light-hearted tone. I wish it? you could break that pot. That would be great. No. Just like rip it break from it. her hands. And just <gasps> throw it on the ground. That's kind of what you do in in. <laughs> got one <laughs> rupee. <laughs> and then the lady's just like, but that was my that was my work. That was my payment for the day. I gotta feed my child. <laughs> and then you just walk away with her ruby. <laughs> no, but you give it to that guy. Yeah, exactly. Ooh. You don't. You weren't gonna donate it. Oh, you selfish. No, I'll do it for you. <laughs> Cause I'm a good citizen. Link is like the neighborhood watch committee, <laughs> like the overly assertive neighborhood watch committee. <laughs> She's like, what you got in that pot? <laughs> you got drugs? You got pot in that pot? <laughs> You're not you mind gonna, if I take a look inside? You're not gonna donate to the homeowners association picnic. Oh, that's your lunch <laughs> money. <laughs> I'll just take that. For you. I need some lunch. <laughs> you gonna buy me lunch? You can do that though. In Wind Waker, there's that lady that like walks around on Outset Island, and she's got a pot yeah. on your head. You just walk up to her and you wreck her pot, and she's just like, "Oh my pot!" <laughs> I was practicing the art of like pot balancing, <laughs> and you ruined it. Oh, I thought that guy had a face coming out of his face. <laughs> like a sinner. <laughs> Don't most people have a face coming out of their face? Didn't we just pass that guy? <laughs> I know, the two-faced guy. No, like a face coming out of the side of his he's face. He's everywhere. He's, he's, I feel like he has like a, like a twin. Like, what do they call him? Like, like parasitic twin. Parasitic <laughs> twin is his face. His other face. I really have no- we have not accomplished anything yet. No, we have not. We learned a hidden skill, I suppose. That's something. <laughs> and we stared at Link's disgruntled face for like five minutes. Oh, oh, we're gonna turn in some bugs, I think, after talking to this creep. Entry totally useless. <laughs> well, what's up with you? You have some business at Agatha's castle. This isn't a castle. What about you? You don't look like you'd be friends of hers. <laughs> yeah, you either. <laughs> I wonder if he, like, creeps her out to any degree. <laughs> I know. I feel, like, she's into bugs, so I feel like not a whole lot creeps her out. I, like, the details. I don't know. Like... She's probably into bugs because people creep her out. <laughs> Maybe. I don't know why they put so much detail in this room. Like, this is such a tiny part of the game, but they put so much detail into it. It has its own theme and everything. I know. It's a nice theme. I can play this on the piano. Oh, that's cool. You should give me the sheet music. Unless you learned it by ear. No, I didn't. Okay. <laughs> I'm not that good. I probably, I don't know. I mean, it's not like super complicated. Oh. I, if I had patience, I Well, might... you did the, that. I thought you were a grasshopper. But you're not a bug. You're a person. Still, you're wearing those clothes. So that tells me you like bugs, too. Oh, boy. Oh, my gosh. Is this the first time we've been in here? I think so. Snap. <laughs> Formalities. <laughs> I've invited the 24 golden bugs of the world to the ball. But... I don't know if they got lost in the way or what, but they're not here, that's for sure. Oh, damn it. If you see them, would you please bring them here to Agatha's castle and tell me that the princess awaits? Oh boy, if you have a bug with you now, please give it to me. The ball must begin. I have crabs, you can have that. <laughs> <laughs> have you brought a bug for Princess Agatha's ball? I'm gonna have to unbutton my tunic, but yeah, sure, I can donate to the cause. I don't mind. <laughs> Of course you don't. This is the first time. Oh, see, this is the first time for Link, too. It's okay. <laughs> it's a special experience. It is. Oh, boy! Who's your friend? You're a little ant, aren't you? You little cutie. <laughs> little ant, little ant. 
I might mistake you for a grain and put you in my cereal. And then eat you. <laughs> oh, boy, thank you so much. I'm so happy. <laughs> you actually went on a bug <laughs> <laughs> Poor mattered princess. <laughs> oh my god. You can keep it in this. Yay, a wallet! 600 rubies. Heck yeah. If I were a rich man. There's a partner. We gotta go find the partner. No. The ant's gotta have a date to the ball. All the lonely insects. <laughs> <laughs> they come from high rule fields. <laughs> <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> we have another bug. <laughs> Just get this over with. <laughs> oh, this one! No! Oh, man. Yes. You, got, you gotta do this one. Shut up. <laughs> oh, boy! Who's your friend? You're a little stag beetle, aren't you, you little cutie? Uh-huh. Little stag beetle, little stag beetle, your spiky pinches are so sharp. They must feel so good. Oh! <laughs> you sure you don't want my <laughs> uh, oh my god. That's like the infamous one. That's the infamous line. So good. So good. <laughs> this girl's gonna have like a fetish. I'm pretty sure I was like crying right here. That's why this is taking so long. Of course. Oh boy, thank you so much. I'm so happy. I'm yeah, sure you are. So happy. Oh my god. <laughs> Allow me to share this happiness with you. She like, she like has bedroom role play of like being a stag beetle. I think that's what happens. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, we gotta get more bugs. And I passed that bug earlier and it upset me. Or I feel like I might have passed it and we just couldn't get to it yet. Because we don't have a certain item that we will be getting soon. 